when all this was going on that you were on to something, that you were mixing rock and roll with, with horn section? I mean, that really wasn't done at that time. You were well, kind of like groundbreaking Wally for music. Brought the, uh, uh, Walt brought there, approached Liamis about the idea of, of forming a rock and roll band right. with a horn section. And uh, like Robert said, at, at that time, R&B was the pop music of the day. So right. that was kind of what we jumped on in terms of having material to play in these clubs where we wore shark skin suits and did steps, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Gigi, blah, That's blah, right. blah. We were a, a, a Vegas act before. Was that the before missing links or the big thing? That was the big thing. And we played Top 40, which was like Sam and Dave, Wilson Pickett, yeah. Ford Tops, Temptations, bada bing, bada bing. And then the Beatles came around and changed our lives, and, and we started also, doing their songs. Also, the Vanilla Fudge came out with an album, and they were doing cover songs, but they were doing arrangements. Expanding. That's right. And we started doing stuff like that, and that sort of evolved into us doing full-on original like to do stuff to our guests who come here and I don't know how many shows you've seen before but we like to do a little surprise we like to surprise our guests with a <laughs> question from a surprise guest okay so take a look hi I'm Jerry Beckley I'm Dewey Bennell we are the band America hey you guys well as you know we've been friends since pretty well the beginning of both of our bands but it wasn't until last summer summer of 07 that we finally had the opportunity to tour together then Dewey and I had the chance to sit in the wings and watch you guys night after night, song after song, do what you do best. It wasn't until then that we really got to see exactly how old you guys are. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. There he goes. Yeah, that was a terrific tour. I love seeing our logos together, Chicago, America. And uh, it was a thrill to join you on stage every night. And thanks so much for including us on that tour. We have a couple of questions for you. Uh, I've read a couple of times that in the conceptual uh, start of your band, you were hoping to combine the sound of the Beatles with horns. When I think of that, I think of the great song, uh, Got to Get You Into My Life, on the Revolver album. Um, and my question is this, was that a song in particular that pointed you in this direction? Or was your idea really more kind of conceptual? Uh, if there were some more examples, I'd love to know what they were, songs that kind of steered you in that initial direction. We love you guys. Take care. Keep making that great music. All the best. Peace. Sweet. Very sweet. Oh, nice. well, Re Revolver was one of our favorite albums, every, every Beatle album. And uh, we did that song as a cover. Oh. And because it did have horns in it. When we heard the Beatles with brass, it kind of gave us one template to, to, to aim for, to work with. 